Rishi Sunak will choose whether or not to invite Prince Harry to the coronation, not the king. If Prince Harry will be invited to the king's impending coronation this spring is yet unknown. According to a royal expert, the king has no control over Prince Harry and Meghan Markle's attendance. Instead, Rishi Sunak and his top ministers in the current conservative government are responsible. The big day is in 12 weeks, but invitations have not yet been distributed. Richard Palmer, royal journalist for the Daily Express, said, I'm going to be amazed if they don't get an invitation, during the most recent episode of Royal Roundup. In the end, it's up to the government. Therefore, Rishi Sunak and his senior ministers would have to give an explanation of who was invited and who wasn't, along with their reasoning. He continued, it is impending nevertheless since invites will be sent out very soon, in response to host Pandora Forsyth. In addition, Mr. Palmer stated that he would be surprised if the Duke and Duchess of Sussex were not invited. When asked subsequently about the potential timing of an invitation, he continued by saying that Mr. Sunak will eventually have to bite the bullet and make a decision very soon. Earlier this week, while on a royal engagement in East London, Charles was seen interacting with some fans and students. One man said, Bring back Harry please. Can you please bring him back please? Sir, as the king made his way around the well-wishers. Who? Was returned, obviously not understanding what the man was saying. The man then said, Harry, your son, which was overheard. Charles trembled as he anxiously responded, it would be good, after realizing what the stranger had said. Harry's upcoming attendance has drawn some criticism in light of his most recent assertions in his spare memoir, which was published this month. In his autobiography, Harry makes very serious claims against members of the royal family, including his father, older brother, and stepmother. The coronation, which will take place over three days from May 6 to 8, is anticipated to attract interest from royal enthusiasts around the world. Archie, the small son of Harry and Meghan, turns four on May 6, the day of the coronation. After success with a book and Netflix, Sussexes are about to sign new lucrative contracts. Following their recent accomplishments, Harry and Meghan are much sought after by the American entertainment industry. Prince Harry and his wife Meghan are about to sign a number of huge new contracts, solidifying their position as Hollywood's hottest power couple. Their successful six-part Netflix series Harry and Meghan and his best-selling book Spare have put them in pole position to negotiate further more expensive contracts. According to a top studio source, they currently possess the Midas touch. The world is changing for the better. Along with their book, TV, and podcast deals, the duo is still listed as a $1 million per booking speaker at New York's Harry Walker Agency among Barack and Michelle Obama and Bill and Hillary Clinton. The 38-year-old Harry is also in high demand as a TV personality. He was serious about guest presenting on NBC's Saturday Night Live, it was revealed last week. At least two U.S. networks are planning sizable proposals for Harry to be a studio analyst during his father's coronation, the Sunday Express reported last month. He is aware that he might likely command the highest pay in late-night TV history, according to our production source. But before Harry's individual passion project, Heart of Invictus, is launched, they must renew their multi-year, £82.7 million contract with Netflix. According to our source, there have already been discussions about extending and improving the bond between them by early contract renewal. Even if there have only been a few production hiccups so far, Netflix is aware of the huge opportunity they have at a time when interest in the British royal family is at an all-time high. However, things won't be as simple with audio giant Spotify, which pays them £20.6 million and hosts the Archetypes podcast by 41-year-old Meghan. Their champion there, Don Ostroff, is stepping down, and their friends the Obamas have left for Amazon's Audible.